A murder, a jailhouse snitch wearing a wire, and a plot to kill a witness sounds more like a movie than real life. But all of this and more happened in United States v. Mack, a case where the court looked to the federal rules of evidence to see whether a prior out-of-court statement is hearsay. Dominique Mack and Taekwon Lucian conspired to murder Charles Jernigan, a would-be witness in a different criminal case where Mack was a defendant. Lucian and Mack were both in jail and spoke during joint visits. Mack told Lucian that Jernigan would work with the police and that Mack therefore wanted Jernigan killed. Lucian later spoke with his cellmate about Mack's desire to have Jernigan killed, saying, quote, Big Mack, he wants CJ gone, unquote. Lucian was unaware at the time that his cellmate was working with the government and was wearing a wire that recorded Lucian's comments. Both Lucian and Mack were charged with conspiring to murder Jernigan. Lucian pleaded guilty and agreed to cooperate with the prosecution for a lesser sentence. In his testimony, Lucian testified that Mack was responsible for planning to murder Jernigan. The prosecution also played the wire recording, which took place before Lucian was ever offered a lesser sentence. Mack challenged Lucian's testimony because Lucian had previously testified that he didn't know Mack was involved in trying to kill Jernigan. Mack was convicted of conspiracy to commit witness tampering. Mack filed a motion for a new trial. Mack claimed that Lucian's jailhouse wire recording shouldn't have been admitted because Lucian only testified about Mack's involvement because Lucian would be given a lesser sentence. Mack also claimed Lucian falsely testified about Mack's involvement due to a personal vendetta against Mack. 